I started. I was talking to my brother. I'm sorry. I clicked go, but I started the stream. God Julia was it. Julia was late, but I started the stream. The stream got started because I started the stream. I gotta hold on. I got. I'm gonna tweet. Hi everyone. <laughs> I'm gonna tweet. Hi everyone. The stream got started because I started the stream. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. I started it. Twitch. I'm gonna turn it more so oh, Karina's. Wait, it needs other words other than just the link. Karina's more. <laughs> Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> Please just tweet the word Twitch. Tweet the word Twitch. <laughs> Hi everyone, my name is Jacob and I started the stream. I'm here with Karina and Julia. They did not start the stream. I want you all to know I attempted to just tweet the word Twitch. Instead I wrote Rwitch. Please just tweet the word Rwitch. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. People, they'll know what you mean. Yeah, true fans. True fans. Done. Did you just tweet the word Rwitch? Yeah. <laughs> only true fans will come to this stream this one's a true fans only yeah. stream experience stream extravaganza excuse me <laughs> we got some subs um, three linked branches and fungal robot and green jean bean all subscribed oh, wow. Thank you. to our rewitch chat <laughs> rewitch channel they subscribe to our chat and only our chat they subscribe to our chat <laughs> Uh, this is a mug, and I'm gonna give it some eyes. Good. This is this mug can see you. <laughs> new new mug technology. The, <laughs> the mugs, mugs that can see you. The mugs can see you now. It makes eye contact with you while you sip from it. Yeah, I mean you think it's making eye contact, but it's hard to tell because <laughs> the eyes are kind of just these big. It could be looking anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> and you won't be sure of where it's looking. But you do know that it can see, and it does feel <laughs> pain when you put hot liquids into it. I did a proper tweet, kind of. <laughs> kind of. I just want everyone to know I kind of properly tweeted. Yeah, Nathan is not here today, so we're having an unsupervised stream with lots of unsupervised energy. <laughs> And you know what happens when we're left to our own devices. <laughs> I tweeted Rwitch, and someone just responded with, you okay? <laughs> <laughs> you all right? Rwitch. <laughs> if you're not down with Rwitch, then I don't even want to hear you, concerned. and I don't want to talk to you. Realistic dog, magic impact. Subscribed. Also, did we shout out We absolutely Kistrin. did not. Kistrin. Kistrin 2020. Also, the Mergay <laughs> subscribed, and... Mr. Ronnie, uh, subscribe. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> this mug can see and it can smell. Sean in a shoe. Subscribe. <laughs> but it, I'm glad you read that one because I was going to mess it up again. <laughs> <laughs> I've read that one before wrong and I was going to make the same mistake. I was going to risk it all. Dory, yesterday in our secret sleepover talk. society, in fuck? our secret <laughs> sleepover society stream, I said, Nugget Maper loves onions, just for you. <laughs> just for me? Yeah. Oh, did they hang up pictures of themselves everywhere? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Our video team put up photos of themselves all over the desks so and offices. So it's like they never left us. So it's like they never left us. <laughs> Jacob, this is a very good mug. I like this nose. Thank you. He, I don't like the X over the mouth. He can see and smell, but he cannot speak, and that's the perfect mug. I don't like that the X isn't a proper X. He sweats. I guess. He sweats. <laughs> he sweat. It's sweat. He sweat and he suffer for you. Let's draw something. Let's draw something. <laughs> Suggestions for Jacob. Suggestions, please. Sug su Jacobs. Gnail stare. Wow. Gnail it's Nalister. We've been over this so many times <laughs> with this exact stare. name. It's Gnail Ganale stare. Ganale stare. Also, Taco Bell killer. It's Nalister. My God. <laughs> anyway, Taco you're getting killer. suggestions and you're not reading them. Draw um, a yogi. <laughs> big old, big old catfish is what I'm gonna draw. Someone <laughs> said big old catfish. <laughs> I will not draw a yogi. Did I will you, not. Did you watch the beat yeah, yet? did you watch it yet? I started it, but then I, I didn't finish it. <laughs> but then it. your feelings got hurt. <laughs> I actually didn't get to the part yet where. Oh, that was during Karina's. You were hurting my feelings. <laughs> Jacob, I just looked at your haircut and went, wow, I did a good job cutting your hair. It wasn't me. 
No, a barber <laughs> cut my hair. Why did you assume it was you? Sometimes I cut his hair for him. <laughs> but this time I didn't. And I... <laughs> do, catfish, <laughs> do catfish have teeth? Yes. Like this? Daddy 24 one. thank you for the sub. Crazy yeah. Chemist 1, that's my favorite TikTok. Um. <laughs> I know they have like they have like these things that come out of their face. Yeah. This is accurate. I'm getting catfish vibes. You can stop here and I would know it's a catfish. <laughs> this is a catfish. Would you know? Yeah. Do they catfish have, have mouth and whiskers? Do catfish have tongues? Yes. For licking? No. Do you think they lick stuff down there? Yeah. Yeah. I miss the show Catfish. I don't know if it's still going on. Oh, I liked the show Catfish. I've yeah. never watched it. It's a delight. Is it? I don't know if it's still going on, but like, I I liked it best when it was the the the, the guy and the guy. Yeah, two guys. N- Neve Neve Campbell. Yeah, Feral Neve Campbell, <laughs> and the wild man. What was his his uh, like manservant Jonathan? <laughs> Max. Yeah. <laughs> Trouserman, thank you for the sub. <laughs> his manservant Jonathan. Yeah. <laughs> My favorite characters from Catfish, the TV show. Neve Campbell and his manservant, <laughs> Jonathan. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I don't know how much of it is fake, but it is very delightful to watch. Set on fire. Thank you. Um. So what do they, is it, do they do good things with their catfishing or no? Wait, what? What do they do? <laughs> yeah, please rephrase the question. <laughs> In a way that makes sense. Are you asking me <laughs> if <laughs> Neve and Jonathan <laughs> catfish for good for, for good, good reason? <laughs> yeah. What do they do no. in this show? Um, do they they, do they <laughs> fish catfish? What kind of catfish are we talking about? Buddy, Is it a show about shoving their hands into those holes in the water to like get the catfish out. <laughs> oh yeah, where you like crack the egg? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is that what they do? Is, that a, is it a show about that? No. <laughs> okay. It's about internet catfish. Okay. And they ha- they help people find the people that are catfishing them. Oh. And then they just kind of passive aggressively confront them. Or sometimes it's like not even a catfish. They're just a weird person who was being a little shady for whatever reason. It's not a bad time. Okay. <laughs> My favorite ones are where they confront the person who is catfishing them. Like, there's one where, like, this woman thinks she's, like, chatting with this, like, hot model guy. And it ends up being just, like, this lonely woman from, like, a state over. Mm-hmm. And they just end up dating anyways. <laughs> she's like, yeah, you know, good enough. And, again, sure you I don't lying know how much me. of this is, like, orchestrated and fake. But some of them get really wild and it's <clears throat> the light of my life. Yeah, I don't care if it's fake or real. I think a lot about the one with the guy where it's this guy and he thinks he's dating like this hot girl and it turns out it's just like this dude who I don't know is trying is trying his darn hardest to be like the Joker and <laughs> they like go to this park to meet him and like Neve has a broken leg and they're just like hanging out and then he comes up the catfish and he's like slow clapping as he approaches and he's like I got you <laughs> but um there's this part where they're like asking him why he did it and they were like you were in um a relationship with a man are you gay and or you know and they're like are you gay and he's like no and they're like but you were like in a relationship with another man he's like you got me there (laughs) and great i think about that all the time (laughs) frogman is subscribed and also dice Drop dungeon subscribe. Thank you. Since when was it gay to be in a relationship with another man? <laughs> Fellas, <laughs> is it gay? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's where that gif is from. It's from catfish. <laughs> this catfish is catfishing someone right now, but it's a <laughs> but it's a catfish. And hopefully, you know, he'll get on the show catfish, and then Neve Campbell and his manservant <laughs> Joseph will fish him. <laughs> We'll fish him out of the river and, and show this poor woman that it was just a, it was a real catfish the whole time. Is his name really Neve? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, but it's not Neve Campbell. That's a different, that's an actress. <laughs> um, who, who wants to draw now? 
You want to go? I can go. All right. I want to keep talking about catfish. We can. We can keep talking about catfish. I will. Please tell me what to draw. Tell us what to draw. So draw Jacob and Julia's Seven. personified. You mean Beastars Volume 1 and 2? Beastars Volume 1 and 2. <laughs> I just draw them. <laughs> can you Beastars? Beastars are cats. Those are just fursonas. Yeah. Beastars are just fursonas. No, it's, it's different. Is it? Can you be stars in a cat? <laughs> you don't have to be stars. Be stars one and two. You can also draw a cat as a fish. You draw a cat fish. You can draw your own dragon sona. You can. Um, Hello Turtle just said, "Make them human." <laughs> Make them human. Uh, Yu Gi Oh sona. Yu Gi Oh sona. Have I done? I feel like I've done a Yu-Gi-Oh! Sona before. You can always do more. <laughs> you can just do more Yu-Gi-Oh! Sonas. Also, a, a behind the scenes, Karina calls our cats uh, B-Stars 1 and 2, and Who? now we've started calling our cats B-Stars 1 and 2. Who started that, though? It wasn't me. I think it was Tony. Well, because you had the two volumes on your desk, didn't you, Jacob? <laughs> I had the one volume. We were talking oh. about B-Stars. I thought you did it. No, I th- I thought it was like Tony was already or like I gave you the volume, volume one to borrow. Oh, and he and it was sitting it on your said, desk while Tony was talking to you yeah. about cats. And he pointed to it and was like, "Is that your cat?" He likes to do that. Where he'll just point to something on your desk and ask a question that's obviously untrue. <laughs> yeah. Man, I'll miss him. <laughs> Gonna miss that guy. You know when your cats kind of do that. Yeah. I don't know the difference between your cats. I just know one Our does, like... Our cats have the stink eye. <laughs> yeah. yeah. One's one a big idiot. I think it's because they both have a, a small cold. Yeah. Aww. They both got a little bit of congestion. Oh, uh, see, you're drawing Olive right now. Yeah! Because you did patch over both eyes. That's, Our sweet that's little girl. classic Olive energy. Okay, so Olive's like, oh, cool, you sit in them, I'm on you. <laughs> oh, you're standing? I'm going to be on your shoulder. I need constant contact. And Olive is like... I want contact balls, so you terrify me. And that's a big <laughs> Here's B-Stars Volume 2. <laughs> she's beautiful. Our beautiful This cat. is your cat. Yeah, she's beautiful. Yeah. She's sitting on the couch or chair. <laughs> so, so our cat is a living comic book. Yeah. This is <laughs> B-Stars, but it's your cat. Wow. You know what? You met the brief. Yeah. So I have to pay you for this. <laughs> yep. Our cat got so excited this morning about food that she threw up and then needed oh. comfort. Yeah, she barfed and then got really sad oh. and needed to snuggle until she felt good enough to go eat the food again. Oh. Big mood again. She got too jazzed, too food jazzed, and I get it. Sometimes I feel that way. Yeah, sometimes you just get a little too excited about food. That happened to me as a kid. Not about food, but it was Christmas morning, and I came out, and I saw all the presents, and then <laughs> you I, immediately, your pants. I immediately ran into the bathroom and threw up because <laughs> I was so excited about the presents. That's so sweet, though. Yeah. I, didn't, I couldn't cope. It's like you didn't even need to know what was in, like, under the wrapping. You just knew that there were presents. Yeah. And it was a lot to handle. Yeah. Then there was another time when, do you guys know Lyle Lyle the Crocodile? No. No. It was a children's book about a crocodile. And I was going to go to, like, the library where someone was going to be in a Lyle Lyle the Crocodile (laughs) costume. And I was going to go meet Lyle Lyle the Crocodile. And I got too excited and I threw up and I couldn't go. (laughs) That's wholesome. Oh, Misty Boy. <laughs> CKO Musician subscribe. And also, we Thank got 500 you. bits from Frogman. Ooh. 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 Here's your cats. <laughs> the appropriate moods. Karina, this rules. Nim 284 and one for the dagger subscribe. Thank you. Also, Karina, yes, this rules. Am I done? Should I? Should I, mean, I pass? Unless you want to draw something draw else. again, because that <laughs> took you like 35 seconds total. I did that one surprisingly fast, despite it having straight lines in it. Okay. Also, I'm realizing about our cats that Olive won't eat unless Joy is eating. <laughs> and Joy wants to eat all the time. That's true. 
draw Lyle Lyle. Who is Lyle Lyle the crocodile? Lyle Lyle the crocodile. Describe Lyle Lyle the crocodile looks. Does Lyle Lyle wear clothes? I'm going to be honest with you. I have no recollection of what Lyle Lyle the crocodile looks like. I'm going to look him up, and I want you to guess. (laughs) Whenever Um, I try to think of- My guess is that he's Southern. When I try to think of Lyle Lyle- He sounds like he wears a hat. I instead think of the PS1 game Croc. (laughs) I think of that crocodile instead, and I know it's not right. Lyle Lyle crocodile. I I never remember what the- Oh- Oh, I like him. <laughs> okay, so it's something like. that Julia likes. Oh, he's cute. Oh, yeah, he is cute. Okay, so he's it's No cute. wonder I was so excited about meeting Lyle Lyle the <laughs> he crocodile. He looks like such a friend. He does look like a little buddy. Here he's walking a dog in a supermarket. <laughs> Lyle owns a dog. It's called Lyle Walks the Dogs. He do that. Oh, my God, this is a very disturbing image I found of Lyle on this cover. Oh, no. <laughs> Look at the feet. Oh, yeah. I'm not sure if I like that. Okay. Actually. I'm getting a lot of information here. Yeah. Know that he's cute, but the feet we're not a fan of. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the he foot looks situation. Like a friend, except for the feet. Noted. Because he sounds, he sounds really jaunty. He, looks like, he sounds like he's <laughs> doing this. <laughs> I'm Lyle Lyle the Crocodile. <laughs> With a name like Lyle Lyle, I don't think he can stand any other way. Don't get too excited, though. You might spew. <laughs> like Jacob. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not a friendly ridge. <laughs> yeah, it's got to be very friendly. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Imagine a crocodile that would make you throw up if you thought you were going to go see it. Um, so Lyle Lyle. What kind of clothes would Lyle... Well, does he wear clothes? No. No, he's naked. He, he's completely nude. Sometimes he wears an accessory an ex- that I'm picking up. I'm, I'm s- hat. Hat's a good one. Because <laughs> if you're going to wear one accessory, I feel like it's got to be hat. Because if it's just pants, then you're obviously shirtless. <laughs> and if it's just a shirt, then you're obviously pantsless. Nobody wins. If it's just shoes, that just makes you feel very nude. Yeah, maybe he's wearing like a little bow tie. That's why Sonic looks so nude. Because <laughs> he's only wearing shoes. he's only wearing shoes, and I think that's wrong. <laughs> Sonic should have clothes. Sonic should have more clothes. Sonic should wear jeans. <laughs> Sonic should wear jorts. Sonic should wear jeans, <laughs> and they become jorts when he goes very fast. Yeah, he goes too fast, and they <laughs> rip up, they burst open. Because of his huge calves. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Got a cute little tail. I really like this guy, <laughs> which I also really like Lyle Lyle the Crocodile, so... And then he has, let's see, how do you draw a foot? I always forget the shape of the foot. That's going to be Guillermo del Toro's next movie, The Shape of Foot. <laughs> the Shape of Foot. Yeah. A woman falls in Forbidden love with a, love. a foot man. <laughs> Not a man who likes feet, a foot man. A foot man. A foot man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just looked at the chat and Jess... 511 just right. Who like anime? <laughs> that you missed the context. I didn't see the context. I just read the comment. Who like anime? Just 511 was talking about later alligator and saying that it reminded her of the, the mafia crocs who like anime. <laughs> who like anime? She wasn't just saying who like anime. Who? I, I do really like the idea of bursting into a chat with that. That who like anime? That all important question. <laughs> who My like dad anime? When he enters a room. <laughs> <laughs> well, apparently your brother really likes shirts. Yeah. Or no, I'm sorry, he wears shirts. <laughs> the rumor come out. <laughs> the rumor come out. Your brother wears shirts. My brother wears shorts. Does does Karina brother is, is wear shirts? shirts. <laughs> For any of you viewers out there who didn't see my tweet last night, I was talking to my dad about what to get my brother for Christmas on top of the thing I'm already getting him. And my dad said just with the utmost sincerity, well, he told me he wears shirts. (laughs) (laughs) I also like to imagine the context in which your brother would have had to tell your dad that he wears shirts. Yeah. (laughs) 
man. I'm pretty sure he was used. He did not mean for that to sound as weird as it did, but it really took me out of the conversation. <laughs> yeah, these need feet are. I these don't like these toes feet. longer. No, I don't think they need to be longer. They're gonna be longer. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want long toes. Stop body shaming, Lyle. Lyle. <laughs> Karina, I do have to say, Lyle Lyle does have human feet. So I was right. So you're right. I knew it. There's only one thing that would <laughs> cause that kind of visceral reaction. Lyle Lyle, why are you this way? <laughs> there's, a there's a doll of Lyle Lyle Crocodile. He's wearing a shirt that says his name on it, which feels wrong. Because then that makes me feel like in every illustration I see him in, that he's nude. Yeah, you should never wear a shirt. Ever. Also, Lyle Lyle is a hard name to say. You really have to, like, pause. Lyle Lyle. Lyle Lyle. <laughs> or else it all just kind of... Sheba, Sheba face. face! Woo! Thank you for the subscription. Thank you. Well, giving out three tier ones. Thank Oops. you for the subscriptions. Well, here's Lyle Lyle, to my understanding. I'll give him, like, a belly. My name's Lyle Lyle the Crocodile. Except <laughs> he would be the mayor of some town. Don't Bear look not. directly at my feet. Oh, I just noticed that we're not even like on the thing that zooms in the thing appropriately. Yeah, I was going to point that out when we started, but I thought you did it on purpose. Look at that. <laughs> now we're on the thing that zooms in the thing appropriately. <laughs> Spoopy juice. Did I, did I get it right? Is this what Lyle Lyle looks like? Yeah, you got to show like? Karina oh, yeah. the real Here, Lyle. Here's, here's adorable Lyle. Aw. Lyle is really cute. He is really cute. Um, but he, his feet. No, wait. Whereas this is upsetting. Yeah, kind of like man legs. <laughs> yeah, I definitely made him a little like strong in the legs. It's more like. <laughs> <laughs> yep, he has like shapely human legs. Lyle kind of works out. <laughs> but only legs. Yeah. Lyle looks like he's trying to sell uh, me. It's because I made it too short. Like a monorail. <laughs> You're gonna have to move all of Lyle over because now one of his feet is hidden behind the webcam. Ah, oh, damn it! Uh, all right, I forget I forget keyboard things. Mara bars. Because it for needs to be a little longer. Mara bars. Mara bars. Get your mara bars. Mara bars. Mara bars. Twenty five cents a bar. Befuddled goldfish. Thank you for the subscription. Ye. For the fourth month. Fourth. Forfed. Forfed. Yeah, you really are making these worse. In some pretty, <laughs> yeah, in some I'm pretty making fundamental it, ways. I'm making it true to how it actually looks. This is like Lyle deserves to be treated. The Lyle costume is on sale at AliExpress. Don't get it. I'll bark. <laughs> we wear it into work. <laughs> oh my god. It's pretty cute. The costume? Yeah. Oh my god, just Aww. seeing it. <laughs> seeing it is making your it. tummy churn. Oh. <laughs> Some ploops just gave out a tear one sub. To vegan Luigi. Someone made a dapper Lyle. Thank you, ploops. Thank, Thank you, ploops. You. Someone made a dapper Lyle costume. Aww. Hello, turtle, my old friend. They made. You've subscribed to us again. They made Lyle wear fingerless gloves. <laughs> Which for some reason really gets me. It's gotta be fingerless gloves. There. This is what Lyle actually looks like, except yeah. I guess he's not wearing a hat or a bow tie. But he could. He could. But he could. Nothing's stopping him. Yeah. Beautiful. He's capable. <laughs> Beautiful, let me in. Here. Get in. Whatever. Julia time. It's Julia time. Okay. Julia, hand me my seltzer. You got it. Oh, thank I you. I see you're not drinking the berry one. I already drank it. What? But I that's the one you didn't it. want. I didn't want it, but you got it for me, and so I drank it. Brian Lee. Thank you for the sub. Thank you. 
somehow Magnus made a special highlighted text that says, draw the ideal manservant. <laughs> Jonathan from Catfish? <laughs> Jonathan Jonathan the manservant from Catfish. Oh, yeah. I got so caught up in Lyle Lyle, I didn't keep talking about Catfish. <laughs> oh, yeah, let's go. What I just wanted to wanna talk say? about my other favorite Catfish moment, which is because um, Neve is like an a feral man. <laughs> yeah. Um, there's one episode where he gets like so mad at the catfish that they're like having this talk confrontation like on a bridge, like by a body of water. And Neve just like gets upset with him and is like, Can you show me your phone? And like the guy hands him his phone and Neve just chucks it into <laughs> the like the river. <laughs> and like the wow. producers <laughs> have to like intervene. <laughs> Because he was not supposed to do that. <laughs> yeah, clearly not supposed to throw someone's phone in a river. <laughs> Neve is a wild, wild man. <laughs> what does Neve look like? He um... also did that that famous tweet where he's like, "This elevator is a no sexism <laughs> zone." <laughs> About like in that. this elevator, we respect women. It was something like that. In it's this like the elevator, <laughs> we respect women, and only in this elevator. <laughs> I want to draw. It's so funny. In this corner, I'm, I'm gonna just quickly draw what I think Neve looks yeah, like. Yeah, I want you to draw Neve. <laughs> Are you gonna draw Jonathan the manservant? <laughs> Should I? <laughs> draw Jacob throwing up. <laughs> This is a nasty stream. <laughs> You're already so wrong. <laughs> you couldn't be more wrong. You think Neve is like a like a strong man. Yeah. Is he not? No, he's like he's sort of a He's the kind of man who tweets this elevator is <laughs> we respect women in this elevator. <laughs> Seymour said, I have wasted my channel points to highlight this message for no reason at all beyond putting it in the middle of the screen and some other stuff about notice them. I did, I, is highlighting messages new? Yeah. What are channel points? Now Gigawit's done it and said, draw nasty boys for Miss Jackson. I don't, I don't know, know what, what that, that means. means. <laughs> is that Neve? <laughs> <laughs> is this Neve? Yogi Sonas. Yogi Sonas. You get them for watching. Channel points are a new thing. They're fun. Oh. And Casey said that we're good people. And oh my God, the channel points. Who like anime? <laughs> <laughs> Great. Are you drawing something? Yeah. You started something. I did start. Who is this? I'm going to. Um, someone suggested Demon Slayer Sona. Somebody did Me, me Heart Yogi. <laughs> in, in emotes. Special boy points. I love Karina's laugh and nasty feet. You can't say that. <laughs> no. I'm going to assume they mean the nasty feet you drew. Yeah, and not my nasty and feet. And not your IRL. nasty feet. <laughs> See, this always happens. Nathan's not here. We get, we get nasty. It's nasty it streams. It real weird immediately. You get some dirty, nasty streams. What are you drawing, Julia? Demon Slayer Sona. Demon Slayer Sona. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Why not, right? Nice. Yeah. That seems fun. YOLO and all that. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I want to do it too now. Yeah, right? <laughs> no, you got to draw your yogi Sona. I refuse. <laughs> I shouldn't be associated with yogi. The only time I was associated with yogi is because Tony was feeding it to me and I couldn't stop him. <laughs> Because I had on a hundred t-shirts. <laughs> Owl Bears and Rickety Rick subscribed. Rickety Rick said, thanks, Drawfee Gang, for unintentionally kicking my months-long art block with all the great Newsday process videos. You're welcome. Glad you enjoyed them. There's yeah. another one coming up soon. Let's do even more of those. I like them. <laughs> I, like, I like them, too. I have a really good time with them. Game time subscribed. Oh, yeah. It's game time. <laughs> Now we're just getting lots of highlighted messages. So many. Now they've, they've already <laughs> lost their meaning. Yogi Sona. <laughs> Yogi Sona. <laughs> um, the state of Arizona wants me to tell you, Julia, that they like your shirt. Thank you. And Lord Waximus subscribed. Thank, Thank you. you. 
So thank you so much <laughs> for that thing that you've done. <laughs> Shiba Face said, baby highlight message dragon. <laughs> Yug. <laughs> Yug. <laughs> it's out of control. <laughs> we did this. We did this. We did this. Yogio. <laughs> 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 I, I have Cam. I have no desire to turn off highlight messages. I think they're nice. I think they're fun. I'm having a good time. <laughs> yami Yogi. <laughs> I'll try Yami Yogi. <laughs> Jacob needs to match Yogi Julia and Sora? Karina's sweater game. I'm wearing a sweater I'm too. I'm not wearing a sweater. Karina's not even wearing a sweater. He's wearing a sweatshirt. <laughs> I'm actually, mine's cashmere. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> it's okay. really soft. Mine's cashmere. <laughs> it's cashmere. Touch. It could be a shame. Touch it. Oh, I like it's one soft. Of the cashmere sweater. They're very warm and very soft. I'm wearing this this clothes because we went to the museum today. And you I couldn't to tell by like, my sticker. I wanted to look like a museum guy. <laughs> wearing, you wanted to look like a person who goes to two stickers. A yeah, I wanted to look like a guy who would go to the museum. I went to the post office today. Nice. Yeah, I can tell. You look like someone who would have been at the post office. So like someone who skips the line at the post office? Because that's who I am. You skip the line? I pre-do all my packages, so oh. I'm just like, I just wander around looking sad until someone tells me where to put them. I, I was thinking you had, like, because you have to go so often, you have, like, I have an in. Delta, like, Sky Miles points for the post office. I wish. Uh, we got a subscription from Heli, and also from Weltramente. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Both for all that you do. Right now, you look like you're doing a Vash the Stampede cosplay. <laughs> a little bit, huh? Yeah. Well, I decided that at this time period, relatively... Uh, in France, they would be still wearing those like little cape cloak things, and that would be dope as hell. You gotta get a cape. You like, gotta get a cape. <laughs> I ordered one. Yes. Um, <laughs> the so I figured uh the closest translation I would have to like the uniform that they wear in Demon Slayer is like the French police outfit, which is that like cloak that like half cloak thing. It's a cool look. Hell yeah. It's bold of you to assume that France also has demons in need of slaying. I mean, Everywhere they do. has demons. <laughs> <laughs> France probably had their own separate issues. <laughs> yeah, the rich. <laughs> They're the real demons. Yeah. <laughs> Can your weapon be a guillotine? <laughs> oh my god, like a guillotine blade? Yeah. I'm gonna like. Cam said in Supernatural, it's canon that Europe has gotten rid of all the monsters. Wow. <laughs> what? <laughs> Europe got rid of all their monsters. Is that why it's just shenanigans around like small town America? <laughs> yeah, where all the monsters still are. Yeah. Other people are saying you should have a foil as a weapon. I was gonna say maybe a foil. Fat Man Dwayne subscribed. Thank, Thank you. you. That's his name. I wasn't just making a judgment call about Dwayne. <laughs> I would hope not. <laughs> Dwayne, The Rock, Dwayne. The Rock. The Rock. <laughs> <laughs> Dwayne, The Rock, and The Rock. <laughs> Sword and Baguette. <laughs> Mara Bar said this kind of looks like Riza Hawkeye. That's because if Julia ever draws herself, it looks like <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Riza Hawkeye. I guess it would be angled if it were a guillotine blade. I'm trying to decide how this thing looks. Yeah, that's about right. Is it you just have like a guillotine blade? Should I have a guillotine blade or should, should I have a foil? You just have like a whole guillotine. <laughs> yeah, you wheel you like... around in a wagon. Ah, get in! <laughs> I mean, it'd be pretty cool if you, like, confronted a demon and just slammed down a full guillotine and then wrestled it in there with your bare hands. 
<laughs> By the end of the night, you're going to be in this thing. One way or the other. Okay. <laughs> so I think I think I am going to make a, a guillotine. A full guillotine? Uh, no, guillotine oh. blade, sorry. <laughs> Because I hate when I say some super natural bullshit and they read it out loud. Well, like, then don't like say that. it. <laughs> if you don't want it read out loud, don't say it. Moobot warns you all the time yeah. about this. <laughs> Have you not been listening to Moobot? <laughs> Moobot could not be more clear about the risks. <laughs> mm-hmm. I can't help it. I used to be a supernatural. Now it's like the end of the decade and all those like 2009 versus 2019 whatevers are going around. There's like the fandom one. I'm just like, oof. <laughs> <laughs> oof, this decade. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm proud to say that I participated in no fandoms. God, I wish this that whole me. decade. And I intend to continue not participating in any fandoms. <laughs> I already posted it, but just... Nice and strong. Started off on Hitalia because <laughs> it was 2010, and that's just how things were. It was a different time, and then immediately went into Supernatural after that. <laughs> I think Avocado. I got into Doctor Who. But were you in the fandom? This is no. what's crucial here. I'm not a fandom person. Yeah, like I got into Doctor Who, but I didn't really like participate in it. No. Like, I'm not big on fandom. I just like making fan art. Yeah. So I kind of participate just through association. Yeah, I feel like you're you're a part <laughs> of fandoms because people really like your fan art. So it ends up, you end up inadvertently being a part of it. Yeah. <laughs> All fandoms are uh, toxic. That's true. There's a whole website. Yeah. <laughs> no! <laughs> and Nathan's not here. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? We're being what? haunted! Somebody just wooed. Feral animal. Yeah. It's like a Ric Flair pro wrestling. Neve Catfish is in the building. Neve Catfish is here. He's howling Neve in the Catfish. hallway. He's sniffing us out. Yeah, he's going to throw our phones into a lake. <laughs> <laughs> Omato said, "Where's the line between fandom and just being a fan?" I think it's participating in the community. Yeah, is what makes you a part of the fandom. Yeah, if you just like watch a thing and are like, "I like that thing," and then just continue on with your day, then you're just a fan. Yeah, that's the difference. If you ever speak about it with anyone, <laughs> <laughs> you are fandom now. I went to a fan convention like a year ago as also kind of just like an excuse to go to a different city, which was nice. It was a it was a nice trip because I wanted to go to Toronto anyway. Nice. And there was a fan thing happening and I was like, I like the show. I'll go. Why not? And then I went, ooh, right, fandoms. Mm. <laughs> I mean, you know you're going to have to disclose what you were going to. Yeah. Uh, I went you to the- just, like, halfway asked this that was very intentionally vague yeah <laughs> <laughs> i went to uh, a winona herb convention which generally winona fans very nice but also i think i think just fandoms aren't for me you know they crazy sometimes they crazy sometimes yeah. It's just like the the weird, I don't know. <laughs> Except for the Drawfee fandom. hey I haven't really had a problem with the Drawfee fandom so far. Yeah. No. To be fair. <laughs> like, so far, so good. Yeah, so, so far, far so, so good. good. But, like, ooh. I like to think we cultivate a chill environment. <laughs> yeah. But also, we're very lucky in that, like, 99% of our fans recognize that we are people with our own lives and, like, we got stuff to do. We're, like... Some of the fans at the convention that I went to were just like, oh, yeah, we're best buds. I see her every convention. I'm like, that's our friends. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they have to see you there. Yeah. I'm like, oh, <laughs> sorry. Red Samurai X subscribe. Thank you. Thank you. Julia, okay. I don't want to call you out. Yeah. But these legs are huge. 
Yeah, they are. <laughs> it's be- it is because oh, is of the, the tilt. tilt? Like, the tilt sure. is like for real down there. Yeah. Okay. It's easier to see like on this screen where it's like perfectly level. Yeah. <laughs> the tilt was very down. You know what? Whoops. Whoops. There we go. Grayscale said, hi, my name is Finn and I spent a long time. Fuck. <laughs> Excuse me? Every time I start reading, it scrolls away <laughs> so fast. I spent a long time in the One Direction fandom this decade, and now I have to deal with that in my life. I respect Fair. that. Yeah. yeah. We um, all have one fandom, yeah. I think. Never forget, I've in this decade, I've been in Hitalia, Supernatural, Sherlock. Um, and then after that, I feel like I redeem myself by just returning to Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Coming home. This and is where I, I was belong. An Overwatch. Yes. Which is, in hindsight is kind of, mm, but it was great while it lasted. <laughs> it was a yeah. good time. It was a great time. All right. How's this? Is this Demon Slayer enough? Do, do I need anything else? Do I need like a power or something? I don't know that much about Demon Slayer, but I like it. I mean, I think what you need is some like big ass eyes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, true. <laughs> it's probably too late for that to add to the space that you've already done. Yeah. H in the chat if you were in Homestuck. Oh, no. <laughs> Julia, I wasn't. No. <laughs> I love it. No, this does not work. <laughs> God. Lord. <laughs> it's horrible. Incontinentio Buttocks. That's a good name. Thank you for the sub. Also, T Spirit Art. Thank you. T-Spirit's heart. Incontinentia Buttocks said, I've never participated in a fandom because interacting with online people is scary. And I that is agree. valid. Because here's the thing. As someone who is technically very deeply involved with fandom, I kind of don't actually interact with communities that much just because I find it really like weird and a lot of work. Yeah. It's a lot of energy. And, yeah. And I'm just like, it's a bit much. It, it, it's often too much for me. Yeah. And that's okay. You just like things the way you like them. Yeah. yeah. Do whatever works for you. Yeah. Do that. Do that. How about? Anyway, this is my thing. I like this. This is cool. Love Where, a cape. What's your other arm doing? That's a good point. Sneaking. Is it coming out of there or is it up in there? It should come out of there. General rule of art. Don't don't try to cheat arms because then people are just like, is that person one-armed? Which is a possibility, but I'm, I got two. You could, I think you could have got away with it if you had made an elbow lump in the cloak as though your hand was on your right. hip. Right. Yeah, but then I would have to turn that Put thing. all hands on hips. <laughs> it's the only pose. There's only one pose and it's hand on hip. Wah, wah. I honestly That's... don't know how people just like stand without having a hand on the hip. How do people stand? Cross arm. If you're just standing cross normally, armed. drawing cross armed <laughs> is hell. Oh, I thought you mean in drawings. Yeah, hand on hip. I don't know. You do that thing where they're just on a white background, but they're doing like a floaty dynamic pose. Yeah, I do yeah. like that thing. Yeah. I do that thing a lot too. That one's fun. Art hacks. <laughs> We missed non-binary robots wow. sub, and it was the, even the 28th month of sub. Wow. wow. So we bid. I blame you. We're truly the assholes. <laughs> Maybe we're the toxic fandom all along. Oh, my God. Look in the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> Don't think you've ever been in a toxic fandom. <laughs> they think Maybe they are. you. <laughs> they think they are the second coming of God. Okay. I'm done. J- it's Jacob time. Go. Oh, hey, it's me. Go. Go. I'm Jacob. Go oh. at you. Go at you. It's me. It is Jacob time. Y'all, I'm having... Oh, first of all, everyone <laughs> suggests things for Jacob. Second of all, I realize that every person that I bought Christmas presents for, I bought, like, two, like, a, a bigger thing and a smaller thing. Mm-hmm. And I thought I was done buying presents today. Huh. I realized I only got my mom one thing, and I don't know if it's okay to leave it at that, but I feel like she needs another thing, and now I don't know what to get her. You got to get on my tip and don't buy anyone anything. Yeah. And also have no one buy anything for you. <laughs> this is key. Yeah. I truly hate buying gifts for people. 
And I also don't like receiving gifts that much. What should I draw? <laughs> <laughs> Jacob dropping some somber knowledge. <laughs> Doug Bug. Doug Bug. Ooh, Doug. Have, you, have you drawn like your trainer sona for Doug Bug? I have not drawn Doug Bug. Mm. I could draw Doug Bug. Mm. Douglas Bugless. <laughs> Douglas Bugless. <laughs> all right, I'll draw Douglas Bugless. <laughs> <laughs> then why did you puke at all the gifts Jacob says pro jangle? <laughs> maybe maybe that's why. <laughs> you know, what the hell's going on around here? I don't know, you're zooming and unzooming. I want to use a different <laughs> brush. I really like using the hard round lately. Wow. With no pressure. Amazing. No pressure jitter. Wow. It makes me happy to use. What is Doug Bug? Where? Let's get like a. Does he wear a little? He wears a little stripy sweater, white, yeah. white and yellow striped sweater. Yeah, he wears a stripy sweater. I kind of want him to have like a like he's he's looking down at you like pathetic. Ghost Trot. We apparently missed the last four resub announcements. Eh? No, we haven't. What? What? I don't see any resub announcements. We don't see it in our in our in our mm. dashboard. They also demand favorite son. I don't see nothing. Bear cub. Who else says subscribed? Pickle the dinosaur says we didn't see them. It's not on our list. There's only so much we can do. We have an activity feed, and sometimes it doesn't pop up in our activity feed. It helps us when the chat is going a little too fast. Yeah, I don't know. Sometimes they don't show up, it seems. Apparently we missed Biscuit Quasar. Well, why are we not getting them all? I don't know. We have subs and gift subs on and bits. Yeah, we should be getting them all, but I don't know. I don't know anything. Sorry if we miss you. Um, chat, chat's a little too fast for us to catch all of them sometimes. Just and our activity feed apparently lies to us. Yeah. So we apologize. But it happens. It's chaos day. Yeah, Nathan is not here. Nathan is not here. Nathan is not here. We have it set up so that we, we, we do our best, but... Yeah, it should, it should show it should us work. all of them. It's supposed to. <laughs> Mike Zick just wrote Sonic with clothes. <laughs> I'll draw Sonic with clothes. Karina's gonna draw Sonic with clothes. Here's the thing about Sonic. I like his design. It's very it's fun. fun to draw. <laughs> I literally cannot remember how to draw Sonic any time that I draw Sonic. I wind up drawing a hedgehog with uh shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll draw Yami Yogi too. You think I won't? <laughs> <laughs> Doctor Discord, thank you for the sub. Thank you. Yeah, all you, Mr. Ranio says all you need to know is he has big hands. Big hands important. Sonic has big hands. That's yeah. what I said during a stream once. <laughs> I said it like kind of to myself because I was looking at Sonic's design and I was like, Sonic has big hands. <laughs> But of course, that's when everyone else stopped talking, and it was As you do. front and center. Negapol says, are Yami Yogi and Clothes Sonic dating? They're married. So please don't ship them. Yeah, don't ship them with anywhere else. They're married. Cannot stress this enough. Mr. Oddball says, why haven't any of you guys been on not another D&D podcast yet? Nathan has. Yeah, it's because we're not in L.A. Yeah, it's because we're not in L.A. So it's a little hard. I don't play D&D, so it's a little hard. Karina doesn't play D&D. <laughs> There's many reasons. There's many reasons. Sonic is married with Elise. <laughs> Guys, I cannot describe to you the amount of excitement that I experienced when Caldwell told me that we had Elise on Drawfee. <laughs> Elise was like the one other internet person that we hadn't like previously worked with that I really wanted to work with. And Caldwell, when we were gathering guests for Draga, was just like, do you guys have anyone new that you want to work with? Like, we have some, you know, some really awesome guests already. 
um, but is there anyone new? And I was like, I got no one. And Jake was like, Julie wants a lease. And I was like, oh, I do. <laughs> Please. Um, she, uh, spoiler alert, is an absolute delight and a treat and just genuinely very funny and nice to work with. And I had a wonderful time. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. <laughs> yeah, she's damn, great. Julie, you're getting savage. Sorry. <laughs> Spoiler alert, she's great. Doug Bug's got like a sort of a bowl cut, yes. undercut yeah. situation. I feel like Doug- You made it look really nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they did. I love this expression that you have. Yeah. This angle is so good. <laughs> well, I feel like Doug Bug is like a bit of a psychopath. A little bit. <laughs> He only cares about the bugs that he can get yeah. or has. Doug Bug lives in a society. Doug Bug lives in a society. But Doug Bug would replace that society with bugs. Magnaz says he's giving a very then perish vibe. That's yeah. exactly the vibe I wanted. <laughs> then perish. And our next big guest that we pull be Brendan Erie. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> That'd be easy to do. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely possible. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just do it. Brendan Yuri and we still need Gerard Way. Yeah, at the same time. Yeah, oh my God. <laughs> Have them both on the stream at once. <laughs> yeah, let's get Lizzo. <laughs> yeah, Lizzo. I feel like Lizzo would be down. I feel like I wouldn't know what to do with Lizzo just because she's like, like... Lizzo would be down. Hell Yeah. To be on the channel, yeah. Lizzo would not be down to be on. We'd not be able to talk to Lizzo. <laughs> but she's like, I don't know. We're I, not allowed to speak to Lizzo. I guarantee you that. Lizzo would probably think we're cool. Yeah. I like to imagine. Positive. This is like my fantasy. <laughs> that Lizzo thinks you're cool. Yeah. <laughs> Lizzo thinks you're cool ASMR. <laughs> <laughs> point of view Lizzo compliments you ASMR <laughs> <laughs> wonderful I feel like if we had Lizzo on the channel I would not know what to say to Lizzo I'm just like I think it's nice and healthy to imagine what it would be like though yeah <laughs> well it'll make you a better person also covered by the webcam whatever you're doing right now that like, is true. It like is I care. Covered. I guess. I guess so. <laughs> like I give a shit. <laughs> I do give a yeah, shit. Yeah, Beyonce went to my high school. Let's get Beyonce. Really? <laughs> Technically, yeah. She Technically. didn't graduate from it, but she was there. All right. <laughs> so we can claim her. <laughs> Got to put this pokeball in a way that you can see that it's a pokeball. Circles, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Love it. Love it having a great time drawing my friend so my friend went to um purchase college which is she purchased a college <laughs> whoa she just went out and did that <laughs> no he went to purchase and but he um, couldn't purchase it he could not it was already no. bought it was already bought and uh their claim to fame is that they get a ton of famous musicians that go to their school for three years and then don't graduate and then leave and become successful. <laughs> <laughs> they Damn. have um, savage. Um, oh my god, who's the who's the woman who sings Nobody? Mitski. 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 I think yeah. Mitski went there. Huh. Um, who else? I don't know if you knew this, but Mitski's actually the best American girl. Regina Spector. Went to purchase. Damn. Yeah. Um, Lenny Kravitz's daughter goes to purchase. Zoe Kravitz. Zoe Kravitz. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot wow. her name. Wow. Went to purchase. I don't know if she graduated. Um, who else? There were more people that went to purchase. Why well, graduate from anywhere? You know. Yeah. I don't know. That that didn't mean anything. <laughs> <laughs> Josh Hartnett went to purchase. I'll be the first to admit. Is this just a list of people who went to purchase? Yeah, who were famous. This Josh Gad. Yeah. Josh Wesley Gad Snipes. Went to Moby. Leslie Stanley Snipes. Tucci. Stanley Tucci. <laughs> Ving Rhames. Oh my God. This is. 
for quite a list. Too bad I don't know who anyone is ever. Yeah. These are all people. These are all people. <laughs> <laughs> At the end of the day, it turns out it's all people. Kind of sucks. Mm hmm. Parker Posey. Do this. Like this. Anyway. This is going to be a sizzle to beat. This is going to be Aww. my favorite son. Oh, I got a Gigantamax one on surprise trade. I was happy because oh, I hell hadn't yeah. been able to get one. I tried to get one, and I lost the fight. Damn. And I wanted it because it's cool. Yeah. I just think it's neat. What's a damn sizzlepeed look like? Nick Eels says Bacon. the scanner in the library is called Scanly Tucci, uh -huh. and that's very good. Uh -huh. I want new new window chrome. New window new, chrome. New window. Yeah, because this is the baby one, right? Yeah, this is the baby one. It just one. looks like bacon. He has a little mustache that goes down. Yeah. It looks like bakey. Yeah, and then I, he has angry eyes. I know what he looks like. I just don't know exactly what don't he looks like. Don't touch the wow. leaves, says pee and missile, and that is a ref. <laughs> for SSS people. <laughs> I kept misreading PM, no, pin, pin missile. missile. Pin missile. I kept misreading pin missile. As P and missile. Yeah, P and missile. As the thing that makes so much sense. Yeah. P and missile. I don't know. <laughs> I was out of it yesterday. That's <laughs> fair. This bug is on fire. The first time I saw one of these, I was just like, that's some bacon you threw on the floor. It's like, yeah. Somebody come get your bacon. <laughs> this somebody is, come pick up your this bacon. This is Ron it's Swanson. <laughs> it's Ron Swanson. It's an angry piece of bacon. Oh, you know what? I want it to I'm be doing. I'm still trying to hatch a shiny. I just want the satisfaction of knowing I can, but I haven't gotten it yet, and I can't stop. I'm gonna tilt that head back and have him doing the same look, <laughs> looking down at you. <laughs> <laughs> I love this angle. Gotta be a little angrier though. Is Justin drawing after this? That's a good question. Justin! 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 Are you yelling at your phone that's off? Yeah. <laughs> Justin! Justin! I'll see if he tweeted. Justin doesn't tweet. Yes, he does. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what an interesting stance to take. <laughs> I just thought, like, wouldn't it be funny if... If you didn't tweet? If you didn't tweet? Like, could you imagine? Wouldn't that be wild? Wouldn't that be so funny? <laughs> Let's see. He has not tweeted so far. I'm just going to assume that he is. Yeah, probably. He's Justin. If he isn't, well, you should complain at him. That's true. This. Some person just tweeted a DM at me. <laughs> tweeted a DM. <laughs> tweeted a DM. <laughs> Sorry, I was thinking about this weird message. They DM'd me on Twitter, and they wrote, "Hello, can T you help me, please?" <laughs> well, uh... can't you? <laughs> can T you help me, please? Can T you help them, please? <laughs> They need help. Tony, I don't think I can T help you. Is it our Tony? <laughs> no. Are you sure? <laughs> can you, you help know? Tony though, our Tony? Yeah, can you help our Tony? Yeah. <laughs> the problem with bugs is they just got a bunch of legs. They do. And now I just like, I'm just kind of like in for drawing all these little, his little leg yeah. nubbins. Cause they are cute. <laughs> Is the thing. Sizzlepeed is very cute. Yeah. Sometimes our cat looks at us like this. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> this is very good. Thank yeah. you. I say it again. What? What did I do to my brush? What did you do to your brush? I went to soft round somehow. <laughs> mm. Okay. I don't even know, like. I intended not for him to be sort of on his back in a very cute... <laughs> yeah, this is very affectionate. <laughs> in a very cute pose. It's just assume that, like, you know, he twisted. He, t he twisted. <laughs> he t I keep hitting the wrong button because I think I'm using my computer and I'm not 
using my computer. I'm not. Wow, get over yourself, Jacob. I won't. I'll never do it. I'll never, ever do it. <laughs> this setup, we've made it in such a way where uh, none of us are happy with it. Yeah, it's bad for everyone. It's bad for everyone. I don't mind it. Shut up, Karina. <laughs> <laughs> You're fired. I can deal with this. I'm, I'm... Deal with being fired. Wow. Go go you pack your... You don't have that authority, Jacob. Nathan's not here, therefore <laughs> I can say anything. <laughs> wow. It's not like the fans even like you. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I said that just because they've spent most of chat today being like, I love Karina. Karina has such a nice laugh. Wow, yeah. we love Karina's Where's art. Where's all the compliments for Jacob? <laughs> Everyone for Jacob's just been saying, eat your yogi shit, boy. <laughs> F in the chat to fire you're Jacob gonna, and make him You're going to vomit. vomit. You're going to vomit up all that you're yogi? You're going to be too excited. You're going to vomit up all that yogi? You're going to shit your pants, old yogi boy. <laughs> <laughs> BT Dubs Karina Karina Best. <laughs> you the chat like, is going insane. I just see a sea of F's and then one person saying, Jacob has a nice sweater. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. That's right. I do have a nice sweater. Finally, someone acknowledged it. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> I just saw CC as in Karina can digest lactose like a champ. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. I can. I can't. Prove it. <laughs> Go eat some milk. Give me some milk. Eat some milk. I'll eat it in your face. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Uh, here's Douglas Bugless. This like is a, this. yeah, this is wonderful. <laughs> Looking down on you <laughs> as you, as all your Pokemon are dead and you're the only one remaining. <laughs> and he, then he kills you. And then too. he kills you too. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Karina, you want to draw? Yeah. What am I Karina has again? two drawings. Yeah, to I'm doing two. You got to do Yami Yogi, and who's the other one? Uh, Claude Sonic. Clothes, yeah, Sonic and, and they're clothes. in a loving relationship. Yeah. Because I said so. You can say it all you want. We'll make it true. Yes, it is. I own Sonic. Did we I say all these subs? Uh, Nightcore Frazier and Turbo Guard. <laughs> Turbo Regard. Oh. Turbo Regard. <laughs> Not Turbo Regard. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone else we said on the list. Uh, sometimes you just gotta take a break. <laughs> Turbo Guard. <laughs> Turbo Guard. I'm really good at reading names. What does Sonic look like? I don't know. I can't draw Sonic. I know what this Sonic is, looks like. This is that cat that got his ear stolen. What's his name? <laughs> What's his name? What are you talking about? <laughs> the blue cat that's from the Asian cartoon. I think it's Chinese. What? The blue cat. It has his ears stolen. Doraemon? Yeah. Uh. His ears were stolen. That's the plot of the show. <laughs> Is that he's trying to find the person who stole his ears. It's true! <laughs> his What's that ears... blue Chinese cat? <laughs> <laughs> Turns out he's Japanese. Yeah, that's an anime. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> See, I've only ever seen episodes of Doraemon in Chinese with English subtitles. Why? Because the my ex and watched it weird. all the time. He was obsessed with Doraemon, and we would watch some episodes. I love Doraemon, but I've never seen an episode of Doraemon. Neither have I. I just think he's cute. He is cute. <laughs> but I did not know the plot to the show. I mean, I just know he has a pocket mm -hmm. where he pulls out inventions. And there is a boy and there's another cat who's yellow. Who is Doraemi? I don't know. Okay. 
Hold on. I'm pulling up the synopsis of the show. <laughs> Isn't this like a really long standing franchise? It is. <laughs> anyway. Here is Sonic. <laughs> He's a he it revolves around an earless robotic cat named Doraemon who travels back in time from the twenty second century to aim n- to aid a boy named Nobita Nobi. Nobi Nobi Boy. Yeah. Did any of you guys play Nobi Nobi Boy? No. Wow. I'm sorry. That's not the eye. How do we do something? Some of you did never play Nobi Nobi Boy and it shows. What's Nobi Nobi Boy? It's a game made by the Katamari Damacy guy mm. where you're a really long worm boy and your goal is to go down to Earth and various planets and wrap things up in your worm body to bring them to space to feed them to Girl. And Girl is a giant space worm that wants to get to the sun. And mm. all everyone who was playing the game all contributed to Girl's goal of getting to the sun. So there were millions of boys out there grabbing all the stuff to bring them to girl in space mm-hmm. so she could reach the sun. Great. And eventually she did. Good for oh, her. Yeah, good for her. Yeah. Takes a village. <laughs> yeah, it took the whole player base. It's Worm Train. It's Worm Train. <laughs> That's the punchline. Yeah, it's Worm Train. This is a cute Sonic. I like cute Sonic. In clothes. Yeah, I haven't put the clothes on yet, obviously. Here's a really stupid statement that I'm going to say. Do it. That's going to live on forever on this channel. Here we go. But I always forget that Sonic has a head and a torso. I always think (laughs) he's like one ball like a hedgehog. (laughs) Hedgehogs are one ball. That's a fair... No, it's not. (laughs) <laughs> assumption based only on the name and not at all on memory yes yes but i would assume that you've seen sonic <laughs> i have a I used to play times. sonic a lot and yet and yet the image that stays in my head you play sonic but you've never looked at sonic <laughs> <laughs> i've never looked directly at sonic <laughs> i don't care to retain what he looks like <laughs> i don't or care anyone. for sonic <laughs> I don't care to repeat what anyone looks like. You're making an assumption that most people have to make a concentrated effort to remember. I'm looking at everything else. And a body. Mm. For most people, that just happens naturally. No. It's not a separate effort to remember what Sonic looks like. (laughs) It just happens. See, that doesn't happen for me, though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's a you thing. Mm. It's just you. Anyway, he's got Tim's. You can't run in those. <laughs> he's not running. He's going on a date. <laughs> You're going to have people in chat supporting you, though. For whom it is also a separate effort to remember what Sonic looks like. I'm going to draw what I remember Sonic looking like. I yeah, you should, you, you should draw what you are sure Sonic looked like. He's wearing those pants that are, like, baggy. But then they get tight at the ankles. Yeah. Yeah. Someone said that I might have aphantasia. I might. What's like that? Like the Disney movie? <laughs> <laughs> Everywhere you look, you see dancing brooms. <laughs> and that's why you can't remember Sonic. <laughs> What else happens in Fantasia? Um, I don't remember. Uh, they go to the devil. I was yeah, about to say Satan comes Satan's out. There. Yeah, Satan's there but just there chilling. There's like centaurs. Yeah, there's like they're falling in cute love. centaur one. The dinosaurs die. Yeah, I remember that. Dancing hippos. Sonic is Hayden Panettiere. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell the difference between Sonic and Hayden Panettiere? Yes. <laughs> that's that's good. I still True Blood is which one? Hayden? No! <laughs> <laughs> so bad at this. 
Anyway, <laughs> aphantasia uh, is a condition where one does not possess a functioning mind's eye and cannot voluntarily visualize imagery. <laughs> is that you? Is, is that sound? Does that strike? I I should need with to you? remind you that you are a visual artist. <laughs> 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 you must be visualizing something if you're drawing it. Tots. I visualize mood. <laughs> That's the only thing. Here's the thing you about visualize mood. <laughs> here's the only. Here's the thing about me watching movies, playing games. It's all just like a book where I'm kind of like taking in the the mood and the atmosphere and the pacing. I don't remember what anything looks like. I just care about the feeling of it. And the energy, the energy of things. That's why I always say that person has blah, blah, blah energy. Is that what you always say? Yeah, I'm always like, hey, he's giving <laughs> off some sort of blah, blah energy. <laughs> mood brother. <laughs> Julia is the mood brother. But you do also remember incredibly <laughs> specific details about other things. Like what? Specifically, like visual things, or yeah, like architecture and well, yeah, inner workings of clocks, and uh, yeah, that That's stuff's true. like super detailed, close up stuff. But you can't remember Sonic's got a neck. <laughs> <laughs> you can't remember that Sonic is segmented. <laughs> I know how to make it animatronic, but I can't remember that Sonic has a, a head and a torso. Yeah. We all have our strengths and weaknesses. Okay. Drawing Sonic is not Julia's strength, but I do still really want to see your Sonic. <laughs> yeah, please draw your Sonic. As you imagine. I will. How do you hold the hands? Whatever. Mars Jim subscribed. <laughs> Thank you for the subscription. What's he holding hands with? Yami Yogi. Oh, yeah, Yami Yogi. <laughs> They're married. Yeah. This Sonic is very cute. Thank you. Like I said, I think that Sonic's design is very cute. <laughs> I think Sonic's design is very cute when it's done like this. <laughs> yeah, this is adorable. I don't like it when they try to make him an edgy teen. I think he should be cute. Sonic should be cute. Let Sonic be cute. <laughs> yeah, and Mary. <laughs> he finally, Sonic finally got the ring he's always wanted. <laughs> the one, the, wedding the ring. one that always eluded him. <laughs> Julia, that was a good joke. <laughs> Thank you. High five. Yeah. <laughs> I really like that one. Thanks. I'm getting there. I feel like if Doing Yami Yogi is, is open, it's going to get nasty real quick. Oh, you know he's getting nasty. He's getting nasty in there. That's his superpower. Get him in the fridge. <laughs> Don't bring him out. <laughs> but they're on a date. Someone just wrote, Julia's not allowed to make good jokes. <laughs> Fair. Yeah, unsay that right now. <laughs> <laughs> so many J's in chat, which I assume are saying, good job, Jacob, Yum. for all the work you do. Well, I'm trying to undo my good joke. Yami Yogi Bear. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. That's not even a joke. Exactly. <laughs> Is Yami Yoki okay? <laughs> oh my god. Looks like he's shooting someone. <laughs> Yami Yoki. Stay fucking down. <laughs> Yami Yoki will kill a man. <laughs> You are making him holding a gun. Well, you said it, so now I want to do it. I thought <laughs> it would look funny, but I can't, like, visualize hands. You've got a Fantasia, too. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> like, how do you hold a way. gun? Yep. Do, do, do. I don't know. It's like this. Whatever. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's right. That's pretty right. You can't prove it's not right if it if it... Isn't right while well, he's yogurt. <laughs> <laughs> it isn't right while well, he's yogurt. There's no rules when you're yogurt. You show me a yogurt with hands holding a gun, and 
I'll, then I'll concede that maybe I was wrong. This is going to be your next uh, shiny sticker you sell at cons. Yeah. Along with Gun Furby and Garfield McConzo. Because Gun Furby came from one of these streams yeah. in a different setting, but that's where it came from. I I wanted to make the Donald Duck cats into a sticker, but then I didn't do it. <laughs> you still could. I, I still could. I do want to print more stickers in January, so. I want to make stickers. You should make stickers. Karina, help me make stickers. Okay. Thank you. You want to know how I make stickers? Yeah. I just draw whatever the fuck I want, and then I send them to a company to print them. Yeah, that's what I want to do. You should do that. I want to send all of my least favorite drawings <laughs> the sticker company. yeah and be like can you please make it holographic please thank yeah. you make it holographic so that it's rare yeah <laughs> are his toes out yeah nice <laughs> he's not wearing shoes he's he's not wearing any clothes <laughs> yeah a gun <laughs> guns aren't clothes <laughs> anyway here's jacob <laughs> Magic Impact had a very nice message about how their mom said that it's going to snow and they hope we get home safe. Anyway, here's Jacob. <laughs> also, thank you, Magic Impact. Thank you so much, Magic Impact. Guess I'm fucking dead, huh? <laughs> yeah. Because I got shot in the head by Yami Yogi. And Sonic loves it. <laughs> Sonic's a himbo. <laughs> He's got... He's got that kind of energy. But Yami Yogi's a himinal. (laughs) (laughs) But Yami Yogi's a himinal is quite a statement. Touche. Touche. Oh my god. He's he's strawberry flavored because I like that flavor. That's good Yogi. Yeah, I love a good. Yogi. I think he's good wearing yogi. a little strawberry shirt. <laughs> yeah, but he's not. He is naked. <laughs> Make no mistake. <laughs> okay, I'm done. I should go. <laughs> I should go. It just leaves. Go Time home. for you to leave. Take your Bye. seltzer and go. <laughs> All right. So my Sonic. Yami Yogi is a himinal as a sticker, please. <laughs> you should just make like word art of all the horrible things you say. <laughs> and release them as stickers? Yeah. Hmm. It's possible. It's a thought. It could happen. <laughs> Yami Yogi as a himinal is not a bad thing. That's a good thing to say. Yeah. I'm glad I said it. I will admit that one was very funny. Thank you. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> This is Eggman. <laughs> Eggman. Not everyone is Eggman. <clears throat> but yeah, make a sticker that says nothing should live underground, but in like cool font. Yeah. Yeah. I need to <laughs> talk to someone who's good at letter drawing. <laughs> you know when you draw letters? Yeah. <laughs> is Mark good at letter drawing? Probably. We should collab with Mark. Mark's good at a lot of things. We should all collab with Mark. Let's all collab with Mark. Mark is going to teach me how to do risograph. That wasn't agreed upon, but he said he could, so. So now it's agreed upon because you made it public. (laughs) Got him. (laughs) So you think this is Sonic? (laughs) This Sonic looks more like an egg than a lot of the eggs I've seen you draw. And, but He's I mean that. I mean that kindly. Yeah, this is tank song. Yeah. <laughs> Eggman, 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 Eggman. I'm coming to get you, Eggman. Hello. <laughs> He's too fast. The speed is too much. He looks uncomfortable with how fast he's gone. <laughs> this performance. <laughs> this is Sonic. This is always how I picture Sonic. In my Interesting. head. Interesting. Yeah. I always forget that it's like. <laughs> <laughs> not really. Not really, it's not. Yeah, that's Sonic, who's still a tank, but now has a neck. Yeah. <laughs> so okay, wait. Can swivel his yeah, head all can the way we around. please, um... What's up? 
<laughs> Get rid of him? No, never. I like it. I also like that Tank Sonic does not have ears. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, does he have ears? Sonic doesn't have ears. <laughs> Sonic doesn't have ears, right? <laughs> Does Sonic have ears? Wait. <laughs> oh, shit. Wait. He does have ears. Wait. He does have ears. Wait. Oh, yeah. he has ears. Yeah, he's got big old ears. They're right there. <laughs> <laughs> They're so obvious. <laughs> Jacob. <laughs> Julia didn't know either. I don't know anything. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Well, I'm you. the village idiot. <laughs> we all bring a different idiot energy to the table. That's, that's why we're that's such true. a good team. Yeah. We all have to be an idiot about <laughs> different things. <laughs> so that we can be ingenious about everything else. Adam Skate says, Karina, to be fair, you put cat ears on everything. Okay, first of all. Julia, don't. No, I don't. <laughs> don't Garfield this Sonic, Julia. You're garfing it. Don't Garfield this Sonic. You're garfing it. You, you promised you wouldn't do this. <laughs> you swore. <laughs> Only one ear. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't fix it. <laughs> one eared angel. The only reason I know how to draw Sonic is because I drew him so much to draw the Hanzo as Sonic. Oh. I drew him so much to draw. <laughs> Fair. Can you yeah. believe to learn? Can you believe to learn? I drew him so much to draw. And now I know how to draw Sonic. <laughs> Boom. Don't Google Garfield. I don't want to look at Garfield. You did kind of a, a squirt-faced Garfield. <laughs> He's very round. Garfield's eyes are incredible eggs. <laughs> you know I don't know what eggs look like. And you did. You did a perfect egg for that Sonic. <laughs> they look like Sonic. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Now she'll know. Just draw Sonic, and you've got an egg. <laughs> Nathan, come back. <laughs> Nathan, come back. <laughs> so is Egg Sonic married to Garf Sonic? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> they are also both assaulting Jacob on, yeah, the, which, on a date. <laughs> which one of them has the gun that kills me? <laughs> Julia! What is this? No! <laughs> I kind of like this. I don't. <laughs> Oh, I thought that was going to be the hand. It was going to be small. <laughs> I was scared. Sonic has big hands. Sonic has big hands. <laughs> well, that's not Sonic. Oh, God. I just forget about the bingus. Someone's chainsawing it's upstairs. An, it's Neve in the bathroom. Yeah. <laughs> He's trying to go through the wall. <laughs> to get to us. <laughs> so we can um, throw us into the river. What am I drawing? What am I actually drawing? Give Julia a real prompt so yeah. you can get these off the screen. What are, the, are those? What are these? What that, are these? That's Totoro. Totoro. Oh, I thought they were nipples. Garfield would have a lot of nipples. <laughs> Garfield has so many. <laughs> but they're all like way up yeah. here. <laughs> like where a man's nipples would be. <laughs> Let's get some stuff to read. Sonic peed. Oh, that would be fun. Draw Weird Al Yankovic. <laughs> <laughs> Just straight up. Just do it. <laughs> Um, are you, what is this? Oh, this is Weird Al? Yeah. This is Daria. <laughs> That's Weird Al. You really busted out that Weird Al. His I don't hair, know what Weird Al looks like, but I could believe. His curly. I could believe Yeah, it's this. a general <laughs> shape. Yeah, it's stylized. It's a stylized Weird Al. <laughs> At least he's not an egg. <laughs> he's not an egg, and that means a lot to me. 
<laughs> Thank you, Weird Al, for not being an egg. <laughs> There, he has flower nipples. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're joke nipples that squirt water. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Julia still needs a suggestion. She'll actually do. Uh, feel as a hardened detective. Um... The Ruwitch. <laughs> the Ruwitch. <laughs> what would the Ruwitch... What would, okay, so it's a witch. Yeah, would it be like that movie where it was the, the vish, vish. <laughs> but our r- r- witch? Draw Nathan. Nathan. <laughs> Disappointed <the> Nathan. <laughs> Vampire detective. Normal Al. <laughs> Draw your sleep paralysis demon. Toad Oroki. Rich witch is a is a ru- witch. Rich witch. So that is someone who does like. Um, um does like what is it butter eh? in in the witch doth thou want to live deliciously that's a that's a witch that does live <laughs> deliciously yeah i don't know why you said butter <laughs> he says a line about butter does he yes <laughs> do you want to chow down on hella butter <laughs> and only, <laughs> only butter. Hella butter. <laughs> Dost thou want to munch some butter? <laughs> Bro Jangle said, Wouldst thou like the taste of butter? That sounds right. Is that it? Is it, Wouldst thou like the taste of butter? <laughs> What does that want? <laughs> That's one of the top asked questions <laughs> on Google. <laughs> what does thou want? <laughs> Who doth watch anime? Oh, this is unreadable. <laughs> What's that like, <laughs> like the, the taste, taste of butter, butter, a pretty dress. When does thou like to live deliciously? <laughs> So he does. He does talk about butter. He does talk about butter. I've said that damn quote so much. I'm going to choose a different brush. I'm going to choose a spooky brush. That's blue. That is blue. You picked the blue one. Nope. Give me that. Thank you. Wouldst thou like fries with that? <laughs> like um Raven Kalama, Raven Silama. That quote is all Julia remembers. It's the <laughs> only thing you remember. <laughs> this witch better be going absolutely ham on some butter. <laughs> Just face covered in it. <laughs> Like Jacob with his yogis. Yeah, like me with my yogis. <laughs> Rich witch. You better go like straight home and watch our glorious roast of you, <laughs> the beans. I'm gonna watch it tomorrow at work while I draw. <laughs> <clears throat> we got Julia's classic nose out approach. Hell yeah. yeah. That's how you know she's getting serious. Hell yeah. When she go nose out. For some reason, that's always how I've drawn faces, is starting with the nose. I think it was like the easiest point to measure from. Cat Astrophy subscribed. Thank you. Thank Excellent you. delivery. Thanks, Jacob. You're welcome. <laughs> I feel like it probably helps measure everything else out to start with the nose. Yeah, because then you get ear and eyebrow mm-hmm. and it sets the angle. Yeah. A rich witch. Okay. God. It what? just sounds like someone's <laughs> rolling something back and forth upstairs. <laughs> It's Neve. He's throwing everything into he's, the river. He's gone completely nuts. <laughs> I just want to like go home and watch clips from this show because it sounds you crazy. Should. It's fun. Yeah, it's fun. Like I was very into it for a long time, just because I was so delighted by it. Yeah, I've seen a lot of episodes. Always. <laughs> just because it was for a while, it was like the only show on MTV. 
<laughs> it turned on MTV. It was on 24 hours a day. The only thing I see on MTV now, and it's the only time, it's like when I'm at the pizza place, basically, or the pizza place that used to be by my apartment, um, is that, like, thing that is basically America's Funniest Home Videos. There's a show like that now, but oh, they just Rob, talk. Rob Durdex. Yeah. Dick House or whatever it's called. <laughs> I hate that guy. I see him and I'm like, I will never watch a show that has your name in the title. I don't even know anything about him. He could be great. <laughs> I like, but I hate him. <laughs> but I made a snap judgment and I stand by it. As you do most things. <clears throat> Yeah, I don't even know what's on TV anymore. NCIS, TV. according to everything my parents ah. watch. My mom loves Dateline. That's all I know. But it sounds like they want to get rid of cable. I'm like, cool. I haven't had cable in 30, 30 years. Yes. Nice. <laughs> I was going to figure out the actual number, but you're right. <laughs> Feels like thirty years. I've never missed anything less than cable. I never think about it. I used to have a tradition where I'd watch um, News Twelve in the morning while I got ready, and I did that for years and years because that was like our local news channel, mm-hmm. like the Long Island one. And um, I kind of miss it sometimes. Like it seems out of nice. tradition. Like it's always kind of exciting to like go back to my parents' house and they have cable and it's like, whoa, there's so much to do. But then after a while, you realize how useless it is. Yeah, it's just nothing. <laughs> there's just nothing on. It's just all commercials all the time. Yeah, it's commercials so much. And then it's like too deep. Like my parents have not even like a really extensive cable package but they have like a lot of channels and it's a lot of weird shit on there like my dad was telling me one time he's like yeah i found this one channel where like every friday night they live stream like a polka dance at the town hall of this <laughs> tiny town no all and I'm right like, why is that on tv yeah, why is that on tv we don't need that i don't think <laughs> yeah like why do you guys have this channel <laughs> yeah <laughs> what were we watching on the TV like a while ago? Was that boat launch in like Denmark or whatever? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it was like you could watch the full nine hour boat ride. It was just like <laughs> old people waving. It was uh, slow TV. Slow TV. Settle I mean, in. I guess. Like, I can respect that. I, mean, I don't know. Not for me. No. <laughs> I just watch YouTube mostly. I just yeah. Watch a lot of YouTube. A lot of Hulu, a lot of Netflix. Lot of yeah. Hulu. Sometimes I use my friend's Netflix account. <laughs> I got Shout out phone. to friends. <laughs> yeah, I do not have my own. <laughs> watch some animes sometimes. You know how it is. <laughs> you know. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so Ooh, I love the way you're using this texture there. Thanks. Yeah, this is fun. It's reminding me of like scary stories to tell in the dark vibes. <laughs> yeah, this is the butter lady. Nightcore <laughs> Frazier. About <laughs> five tier one subs. Thank you. Thank you. That would definitely be the, the title of the story <laughs> in the book. The butter lady. The story of the butter lady. <laughs> um when we were over the weekend, we went to this cocktail bar in our neighborhood and ended up talking to this couple that was sitting next to us because they were, like, shopping for a Nintendo Switch for their kid. And so mm-hmm. Julia started offering them, like, advice. And um, the guy was, like, this, you know, like, real big, tough, like, bald, craggy, like, old-school Brooklyn <laughs> dude. Mm-hmm. And, like, in the middle of the conversation, he was, like, he was like, yeah, we dropped my, I dropped our kids off uh, down the street at the game store. They're playing D&D. You guys ever play any D&D? And we're like, yeah, we play D&D. And he's like, I've been playing for 40 years. Yeah. <laughs> he was like, you probably play that fifth edition stuff. I play the original D&D. Damn. He's like, I play it with my friends every two weeks. Every two weeks we get together and play. We've been doing that since the 80s. Yeah. I was like, damn. <laughs> I good, like that. good for you. Yeah. Good for him. He looked like a firefighter. <laughs> yeah, he was just like this 
huge, broad, like, no hair, just, like, thick jaw <laughs> dude. Does the Switch connect to the internet? Yeah. All right, I'm going to be taking the Switch because I want to play, uh, play Zelda. You want to play Mario. <laughs> he wanted to play Mario. That's what it was. And his On wife wanted internet. to play Zelda. He was like, I'm going to have to trump up some charges and ground my kids so I can take the Switch and play Mario. <laughs> Mario Odyssey? I don't know. It looks fun. <laughs> Yeah, he was super. He was super nice. Yeah, That's, they both that were. That sounds like a fun encounter. Yeah, they were great. <laughs> he also said he played fifth edition too, so don't judge him for his. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't sound that. He doesn't no. sound mean. He's no, not he elitist wasn't mean at all. Yeah, he's just. Uh, so that is. He was that he was gatekeeping, but he wasn't actually. That is very cute. He was just joking. That was a very wholesome interaction. It makes me happy to hear it. <laughs> he, uh, he he was just like a nice dude who. Preferred first edition, but Aww. that's just what he's been playing for forty years. Yeah, he was like, "Yeah, that stuff's fun, but uh, I just I prefer the uh, the original <laughs> stuff." Good for him. That's wholesome. Yeah, he's like, "Now my kids are DMing." Yeah, he said his nine year old was DMing, and it was like it was like the darkest shit he'd ever heard. And he was like, "All right, you gotta tone it down." <laughs> yeah, he's like, he's you like, gotta tone it down. It's too dark." <laughs> It's like in their group, they're not allowed to uh, to kill animals, and they are allowed to earn familiars if they get to level ten. Uh. <laughs> Flint chemist subscribed. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, he was a he was a real sweet dude. That's cute. Yeah, Julie, I really like how this is coming together. Thanks. I love this some is a cool wholesome drawing. dad energy. Yeah, me too. I'm really excited because when I go back to Houston, I'm going to make my dad play Untitled Goose Game. Because I think he would like it. Oh, I suggested that to this dude. So I'm going to play. force him to play it. <laughs> yeah, make your dad become the goose. Yeah. I'm going to see if it uh, starts a chain reaction of him eventually becoming a gamer. Oh, yes. Operation <laughs> Hell make yes. your dad a gamer. <laughs> Not I'd... because I want him to become a gamer. I just want him to have a good time. I think for the holidays this year, we should all try to turn our dads into gamers. Holiday project. Holiday project. That's our holiday movie. <laughs> Make your dad a gamer. My dad really likes Portal, uh, and Mario, and that, and Jackbox games, and that's about as close as I've gotten him to being a gamer until this year. There's like one game, and I was, <laughs> yeah, it's gonna happen. Um, I was going to get it for my dad as a Christmas gift, but I kind of like had heavy second thoughts and ended up not doing it. But he, there was this game he really liked, um, like Windows 97. And Pinball. Rat poker. Rat poker. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Does that ring any bells? No. It's, it's like this puzzle game that was like in a puzzle pack on Windows 97. And that's like his favorite game. And it's just one of those like, you know, predecessors to mobile games where it, like, um, you know, it's just a puzzle game, but you're, like, connecting these, like, rats. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and it has uh -huh. this, like, little jaunty song that goes with it. And I was going to get him, like, an original, like, CD-ROM that, has, first that edition. has rat poker on it. Rat but poker. then I was like, I don't think my dad's computer even has a CD drive because it's 2019. Yeah. And <laughs> buy him an external, like, CD player. Yeah, I was like, I could just bring mine and, like, do it. But the other thing is that my dad's just lazy because rat poker in the year 2019 is freeware. He could just get it online, but like he hasn't and my brother hasn't helped him do it. So I was just like, why am I gonna spend like actual human money on rat poker when you could just do it so easily? But that's his favorite game. That and um, Hoyle Board Games 97, I think. Hoyle Board Games? Yeah. Who's Hoyle? I don't know. It's, it's a kind of board game. Anyone out there a Hoyle board game fan? Where are my Hoyle heads at? <laughs> yeah, Hoyle fandom. Um, <laughs> oh, is it Hoyle? <laughs> no, it's Hoyle. <laughs> I have, I played it a lot too. And um, it's just, you know, it's like you can play chess. You can play. <laughs> Bees said Hoyle, Hoyle, the crocodile. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Don't make me barf. <laughs> He's gonna barf. I'm gonna get too He's excited. He's too excited. But yeah, um, 
That's like my dad's favorite game. It's just a bunch of board games. And there's these like little like N- NPC characters, like little avatars you can play against. And they're all oh, like cute. specific characters. There's like a great, there's like a great alien and there's like a guy that looks like Pajama Sam, but an adult. And then <laughs> there's, wild there's, there. there's this one like guy with like a raccoon hat and a beaver puppet. And I was, like, talking about it with my roommate because his dad was also a big Hoyle Board Games fan. We're like, the puppet guy definitely voted for Bush. <laughs> and, like, <laughs> but my dad still plays Hoyle Board Game 97. It's on his computer. Wow. And to this day. And he plays it so much that he has the chess AI memorized. <laughs> wow. really crush. Yeah. He fucking owns. You can really crush by it. Speed run. <laughs> he can speed run Royal Board Games 97. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> so he has it in him to be a gamer. Yeah. He has it in him to be a gamer. Steps Believe in you. <laughs> this is my dad's character arc. He becomes a speed runner. <laughs> Do I have a really speed like runner. Your drawing, I should yeah, say. This well, is thank you. The I, chat is the lost The atmosphere. Your mind. Although, like, Looking at that full stick of butter jammed in her mouth makes me <laughs> want to barf for real. Because I just imagine putting a full stick of butter in my mouth, and it's just like, ugh. Yeah, <laughs> it's not. It's not, not a appeasing. Thing no. To think about. But no. that's what makes her scary. Yeah, because like, why would you, why would anyone do that? Does thou want to live deliciously? <laughs> really, don't think so. That yeah, looks she's gross. Yeah, she's like saying that to you while there's a stick of butter in her mouth. <laughs> I feel like Black Phillips just like this is. I didn't really mean like a whole. Stick of butter. Like, this seems a little excessive. I just meant you'd have access to the finer things like butter. Not that you should just, like, eat a whole stick of it. <laughs> this seems a little excessive. But do you, I guess. You could do it to any degree that you want. <laughs> just know that there's butter. There's plenty of butter. <laughs> dresses, all that jazz. Anyway. Everyone in the chat's just talking about people they know who's eating whole sticks of butter. No! They shouldn't. They shouldn't do it. Bad. I'm stepping down as president. You're stepping down. Um, Julia, this is really good. Thank you. Ah! (laughs) I'm sorry. It's what he deserves. It's fine. Okay. It's fine, everyone. I was acting. It was I was playing a role. What should I? I don't have a butter story, but I do have this story from Bridgman, <laughs> who I used to, after every holiday party every <clears throat> year, I used to drive Bridgman home uh, back to his apartment because I would I could do it in like a quarter of the time it would normally take him. And I would have a car at that time. Anyway, one time he was a little drunk and he told an entire story about this kid who kept shoving their face into the guacamole dish huh. at a buffet huh. and that it really distressed him. And he just kept saying, who lets their child shove their whole face into a guacamole dish? Who does that? <laughs> it was very good. Uh, also, we still need suggestions for Jacob. Just, and this is very good. Yeah, I like that because I could hear it in his voice. Yeah. How do you figure out backgrounds when drawing a character? Uh, How do you what? What? <laughs> <laughs> what did you say to me? We should really like do something where we challenge ourselves with backgrounds because I feel like I never do. This is. Goku. I don't know about y'all. This is Goku. This is Goku yelling. This, this is, is Goku. This is Goku now. This is Goku. Okay. Who, um, um, hit his, his... Jacob eating butter. Jacob as fish. Draw your kits. Yeah, you, you could, like, actually draw your cats. But you already did such a good job at it. Yeah, you're right. Um, baby I... yoga. <laughs> oh, Jacob is butter. Um, please draw Regina's dad. Uh, oh, yeah, draw Regina's Hoyle from dad. Hoyle board games. <laughs> oh, my God, Hoyle. I, f- I feel like we should all draw a different Hoyle character based <laughs> off of Karina's yeah, descri- what's your... description. Oh... I'll draw a Hoyle. Hoyle, Hoyle, Crocodile. <laughs> yeah, draw Hoyle, Hoyle, Crocodile. 
I don't know. We don't have time to all do Hoyle characters. True. You can draw your Hoyle Sona. Your Hoyle Sona. <laughs> I don't even know what they look like. It's just you, but you play board games and you're quirky. <laughs> like, what's the version of you that you see playing snakes and ladders or playing chess against my dad for 17 years? <laughs> the only thing I know. I, I, by the way, I love this Goku. Yeah, this is good. Um, this, this is Goku. The only thing I know about the Hoyle characters, you said one of them's like a raccoon or whatever. And that's what I'm picturing. You want to see? me as a raccoon. You as a raccoon? Tanuki Julia. This is what it looks like. Oh, it's gross <laughs> to look at. Yeah, it's from like 1997. Let me see. Stop being rude. Oh no. Yeah. Oh no. Um one of the characters is a bear. <laughs> it's just a straight up bear. I don't like Hoyle's board games, I don't think. Here's the here's the alien guy. I wish that Hoyle had Apparently not. Apparently you it. play checkers against him in the desert. <laughs> That's where aliens live, Karina. Um <laughs> Draw Marvin the dinosaur. Who's that? I don't know. <laughs> Draw raccoon sonas. Dragon, dragon. <laughs> Rock the dragon. <laughs> All right, I'm getting ready to draw something. You Here we go. Something? Let's go. Hot I'm ready Grinch. to do it. Hot Grinch. <laughs> You should draw Hot Grinch. I'll draw, okay. Hot Grinch, I'll draw yes. Hot Grinch. We were making hot um, gingerbread men last year, me and my roommates, and one of them was the Grinch. Give me images. Give me Grinch Give images. Me images. Why does he have nipples? Because he's hot. <laughs> he has nipples <laughs> and really skinny legs. Damn, he's it. so hot. <laughs> so sexy. Incredible bone ability quotient. I feel like, okay, hot Grinch. The Grinch is not a himbo. Jacob, I want you to know that someone just tweeted at us and says they were playing Pokemon and that they got their Dottler to level 60. In a, oh, no, they got a, a level 60 Dottler in a random trade and out loud said, whoa, wow, look at this huge wizard dad. Because <laughs> they couldn't remember the name of the actual Pokemon. Yeah, I mean, that's that's correct. That's the right thing to do. The theme stream for me today has been characters are looking down at you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Ew, why is he looking down at me? He's looking down at you from because he's huge now. He's big now. <laughs> He's big and hot. He's big and hot. Himinal Grinch. <laughs> He's a himinal. He's a himinal. He's a smooth himinal. <laughs> he does a lot of breaking and entering, stealing. <laughs> what is this look? <laughs> <laughs> Do not touch those eyes. Do not touch them. They are staying forever. They... <laughs> I would never touch them. These are perfect. <laughs> Yeah, this is a um, POV. <laughs> <laughs> POV hot Grinch. Ronan says POV hot Grinch is judging that you're not hot. <laughs> no, this is um, POV. You <laughs> that hear looks like a puppet. <laughs> you hear a knock on your door at two a.m. and it's oh. hot Grinch coming <laughs> to steal your Christmas tree. Not hot. I'm taking your tree. <laughs> If you were hot, I would have let you keep the tree. <laughs> but you're not, so I'm taking oh, it. Oh, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> He's got pillow pecs. Hot <laughs> Grinch is here. <laughs> I thought you were going to say... Give a store near you, pillow pecs. <laughs> I miss pillow pets. <laughs> I had two. Pillow pets are good. Yeah, I had a unicorn. And then I had an eagle, but just because I thought it was really funny. Because <laughs> it didn't have wings. It just had legs. I'm looking this up. <laughs> I don't think it was an official pillow pet. I think it was like a ripoff from a mall kiosk. But <laughs> uh, They have a Philadelphia Eagles pillow pet. 
that's the one I have. Oh my god, <laughs> he's like a seal. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> that's not an eagle. There goes Mary my B. eagle. Says, uh, "Google the Dory pillow pet." I need to see. The Grinch does not have ears. I feel like that should be clear to everyone. Hmm? The Grinch does not have ears. Okay, Jacob, whatever. The Grinch doesn't have ears. They're just holes. He's like a a Boyd. Is the Dory does the Dory pillow pet expand? Yeah, I don't we don't we're not seeing it. We're just seeing it's, like a is Dory it just plush. A goofy ass pillow. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I just want this to be like like he's he's really he's too big <laughs> and he's sort of just like coming <laughs> he's coming at you and you know that there's not any like way to escape people are saying give him cat ears please the Grinch does not have ears I just want to see it though <laughs> The Grinch does not have ears. Oh, my God. <laughs> there's an Olaf pillow pet. Of course pet. there's an Olaf pillow pet. But this... he looks scary. Look at his expression. <laughs> He's deranged. It's out of stock. <laughs> Pickled the dinosaur. Or a highlighted message. Jacob, what does hot mean to you? <laughs> Powerful. This is hot. This is honestly, this is pretty hot. <laughs> How did he fit through my doorway? <laughs> it's too late now to think about it because he's here. <laughs> you didn't take the proper precautions. <laughs> He can lift the Christmas tree with just one hand. Yeah. Yeah, with one finger. <laughs> oh, damn it. <laughs> I've got to find all of his weak points. Saving a haircut says, if you change the head, this is furry, you not know, safe for work. <laughs> True. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I think if you keep the head the same, this is furry, not safe for work. What is that line? I have to I have to close all the gaps. Oh. So that I can Oh my god, there's always gaps. It's impossible to close <laughs> off this grinch. Uh by his elbow, yeah. He can't be contained. <laughs> okay, there we go. I think I got him. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we got him. <laughs> Wait, his shoulder, his his arm muscle got stuck in there. No, um, that's supposed to be. Oh, please, okay, cool. um, that's his, sh this. his shredded ass. I am real gonna, quick. Yeah, I am gonna do that. Please, please. I, I am absolutely <laughs> gonna do that. The fact that you were concerned that maybe I wouldn't do that is uh, that's oh too God. big. You have to go a little smaller. That's too dark. Dearly departed. Put down says, another layer so you can. A highlighted message. Hey, That's have you guys idea. thought about how all the Sword Shield fossil Pokemon are the wrong half? What? Well, are you right? Yeah, they are all the wrong half. <laughs> fossil Pokemon? Um, in Sword and Shield, because in Pokemon games, you can collect fossils and just have them resurrected into Pokemon. In Sword and Shield, you collect like halves of Pokemon, and then the person who resurrects them is just like, oopsie doopsie, uh, whatever. And you can put whatever two halves together and they come out looking real dumb. Whoopsie, I mixed them all oh, up. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I'm seeing it, huh? Yeah. Mm, yeah, they all you look... like it? <laughs> they all look stupid as hell. Oh, yeah, it's dumb. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> oh, the text... Someone did draw this, which makes me laugh. <laughs> the texturing on this is incredibly foreboding. Yeah. It adds an extra layer of fur. Yeah. Of threat. Yeah, this is a this is a threatening prospect, but in a way that's like 
a hot. You're, you're, you're kind of into it. I'm not, though. Well, it's like, in this scenario, <laughs> you called the Grinch over. People are saying he's dirty. <laughs> <laughs> In, I did not call the Grinch over. In this scenario. This is the Grinch breaking into my home to steal my presents. In this scenario, you called the Grinch <laughs> over dog. and you were like, you know, surprise me. No. Because you're in a relationship <laughs> with the Grinch. Are we married you're to not the ma- Grinch? You're not married, but you're like, you know, you're seeing each other. <laughs> you're seeing each other and that's fine. Um, can you wrap this up? No. <laughs> I'm busy. <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens when you if you text the Grinch you up. <laughs> I need the line the line work to be darker. There we go. Okay, that actually helps a lot. There we Thank go. You. Now we're in now we're in some sort of business. Chrissy Cutie just wrote this is not very Christian. <laughs> <laughs> it's not oh, no <laughs> you're telling me if the Grinch if strong Grinch showed up at your door fully nude you wouldn't be like alright let's go no let's go bro absolutely not wow Stephanie Child just wrote please save us with a porter I would politely decline Wait, and yeah. tell him to go home I have an idea I for the I was just gonna stick oh, it in real quick no. because we have, to, we have to go back over everything too let Julia do oh, yeah. it well I'll do it real fast hell yeah See, another great Nathanless stream. <laughs> We've where done nothing can go wrong. We've done great. We've done some good work, y'all. <laughs> um <laughs> No. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> Don't defile my beautiful Grinch. <laughs> I'm not happy that you're doing this. I want to let the record show that I don't like this. I like this. <laughs> <laughs> you have to get rid of the nose. This is really funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> he looks work. like a ninja turtle. This works a little too well. It does work well. <laughs> I'd like to invite anyone watching the stream to take this image and put whatever face you want on it. There you go. <laughs> this is unbelievable that you've okay, done this. Okay, we need to wrap up so Justin it's can just, do it's, his it's whatever. It's literally nine okay. o'clock. Whatever the fuck he does, I don't know. All right, our first... Our, <laughs> Our first a drawing. A good sign of what's to come. I set the tone. Well. Yeah. <laughs> Here's catfish. There's catfish. Here's catfish. Uh, Here's B stars. Our B-stars, cats are B stars. Too. <laughs> Lyle, Lyle the crocodile with his human legs and feet. Uh, Julia Demon Slayer. That's a good drawing. That's actually. the most normal drawing of the night. Uh, Bug Doug. Douglas Bugless looking down on you before he kills you. <laughs> Sonic is married to Yami Yogi, who just killed me with a gun. My Sonics. My two Sonics. My two Sonics. Weird Al. Uh, <laughs> Ruich. <laughs> Ruich. Uh, Goku. Uh, Goku. Screaming Goku. The Grinch. And the Grinch and the Porf. And the Porf. <laughs> Y'all stay around for Justin's after after Drawfee stream where uh, he draws. Yeah, Justin's right here. Gonna draw He's right here. Really right good. here. He's in the room right now. The call's coming from inside the stream. <gasps> stay here. Stay tuned. We will see you Wednesday on SSS or Friday, right here on Dropout Live at three. Okay. Bye. Goodbye.